Joaquin Pellandini to get this game underway. Here we go. Heath go after it. Taken by Vilawa for Fiji. Oh, Mathungo. Oh, he's gone. Marcos Maneta's going to chase him all the way. Moneta will have the pace to force him back. It's gone backwards off an Argentine hand. Oh, no, it hasn't. No, it hasn't. It's a deliberate knock-on. And that means two minutes in the Simbin for Marcos Moneta. Scrum option, please. Well, it looked like a scramble, and they'd stopped a certain score. The legal. And the money man's going to take two minutes to count his change. Crouch. He's paying his debts on the sideline. Bind. I'd say he's Set. very much in the black. Seventh meeting of the year between these two. Argentina have won three of the past four. Fiji prevailing most recently in Hong Kong. Tackle. This is Jose Satan Batararena doing a bit of battering. Modena Thangi on the outside. And here's a chance. Waliso Liso. Oh, he's too strong. Far too strong. Stumbling through tackles. Splintering Argentina. Scoring the opener for Fiji. Aliso, Aliso. It's a beautiful timing of the pass for Mathanathangi. And then Waliso, Aliso shrugging off some big men. The way he manipulates his body here, turns his hips, keeps his legs pumping through that tackle. A little 180 to finish. Kick from Mathungu just wide, but 5 0 Fiji leads. Utawala Waliso Liso is the youngest of ten siblings. You wonder how big the other nine are. Fiji hunting the first gold medal since Toulouse 2022. 13 tournaments without a win. Longest run since 2010. Argentina have the ball, though Pellandini wins it back. Still one more play without Marcos Moneta, but Gonzalez is no bad alternative to have. Steaming up the touchline, swatting Fijians aside, eventually three get back to drag him to ground. Alvarez off the deck and galloping away as Hermann Schultz. Against the power play, the six men of Argentina respond in style. It's Herman Schultz with the score, but that was the most ridiculous display of power running you will see from that man, Luciano Gonzalez. Luciano just stumbles, stumbles, stays on his feet. Impossible to bring this man down. And an easy run in from the 22 metre line from Herman Schultz. With only six on the field, Argentina get the comeback score. And it's the go-ahead score indeed, because the conversion is successful. And now Marcos Moneta is back on. So in fact, during that power play, Fiji are minus two. Try a piece, conversion the difference. And only Luciano Gonzalez can do that to Fiji. Salturana off the deck to Wali Solisa, the Fijian try scorer, Nathungo. Showing and going and not able to link with my Samoa. And Argentina campaigning for a penalty because a Fijian player was interfering with the ball on the ground as Moneta went to pick it up. I have to say, I think they've probably got a case there. My Samoa knocked it on, but was then still on the ground and regathered the ball, which stopped Moneta getting an almost certain score. Crouch. Again, Nathugu stopped that. See, the ball's loose, Point. you cannot play that if you're still on the floor. Set. Mineta was sniffing. Pelandini off the base to Verafeld. Rodrigo Ithgro can't lick with Moneta. That's been a, a seriously profitable access for Argentina over the course of the series. Nine of Moneta's near 50 try haul have been assisted by the man wearing number one on his back. Scrum option.
Crouch. Bind. Set. Fiji's turn to attack. Will Awa for Nadungo. Striding through goes Salturana. I think they've stolen this. They have. Alvarez, the skipper. Fiji marched 10 metres and about to be down to six as well for holding on to the ball. It's Nadungo, second player in the bin. And now it's Argentina who'll have the power play. Very strict, stringent refereeing around that in sevens because there's so much advantage to be had from quick ball and quick taps. Any interference, you're gone. 27, Los Pumas tries, scored in today's more than any other team. Bind. And set piece ball. That's been a strong source of possession for them. The bind needs to be longer, please. Make sure that open shoulder. Bind nice and longer as well. Time back on. Crouch. Crouch. The naughty chair's getting a fair bit of action in this game already. Set. Doesn't look the sturdiest from up here. So none of the big boys have to go and sit on it. Here is Marcos Moneta, 44 tries for the year, and he's setting up his old pal. Brilliant from Argentina. And instead of Ithko feeding Moneta, the arch finisher returns the favour. I did not see that. I'll keep my eyes on it. Ithko coming up with a score. I'll keep an eye on it. I did not see that. Watch that bit Sorry. of holding on the scrum here. It's Herman Schultz, just a little hold. Really smart on Batty Roringer, just stopped him pushing off. A little bit of skullduggery around scrum time, nothing new to the sport. Ithgro enjoying himself running over here at London. 31 tries in 62 matches now for Rodrigo Ithgro. This season's series, and he has been such an all-court weapon for Argentina. For Santiago Gomez Cora. Final play of the half. A Fiji stick or twist? Here's your answer. They may have pressed the gamble button a little too hard though. Gonzalez has it. Loads of sky blue jerseys off to the left. The pass gets there after a fashion. Alvarez inside the Pelandini. Eighth throw. What a ball that is to Schultz. And then Schultz rather rifles it a little too hard at Marcos Moneta. And that will bring a chaotic. First seven minutes to a close, a sin bin apiece. Two tries to one in Argentina's favour. And despite that anguished look in the stands, Los Pumas have a two-score lead. 14-5 at the break. Matches in full swing, and next up we are switching back over to Pool A as South Africa take on the USA in 10 minutes' time before New Zealand face host nation Great Britain. That'll get the 55,000 strong crowd going in around half an hour. 
first though we've got a decisive seven minutes between two of the strongest teams on the series argentina in second fiji in fourth both guaranteed olympic spots at paris 2024 next year and who can seize the initiative and carve out victory in this gonzalez goodness me he's like a pinball and now moneta who's more like a whippet Hit on by Verafeld, Pelandini battered it over the top to Ethgro, safely away to Moneta, who's jinking and jiving and kicking and sprinting. And here's that bouncing, Vilawa does just enough, really well covered by Vilawa, and he has got the dancing shoes on. That's electric, Salturanga bursting through, Maisamoa ghosting up the outside, Salturanga levelled. Rodrigo Ethgro atomizes Felipe Salturanga. And now Argentina have it back with Gonzalez. Oh, this is chaotic. This is breathless. There'll be lungs like Chris Packets out there. Ball out. Fiji now pill for the ball. Gonzalez tries to win it back. Alvarez does. It's like grappling on the deck. Scrum unplayable. Referee George blows his whistle. There are bodies strewn all over the Twickenham turf. And little wonder. If you're watching this no, at home, get off your sofa and applaud. Time off. Well, that passage of play was worth the entry ticket alone. I think he dipped. Unbelievable from both teams. She can't believe it. Who else we catch our breath? Let's just appraise you of the... The standings overall, Fiji sitting in okay, fourth, ready, Argentina second, as I mentioned a few minutes ago, both safely unassailable in that top five Olympic spots. But okay, watch for those further down for Australia, Samoa and South Africa, that fifth spot is up for grabs today. Australia with a nine-point cushion over the chase in two. But that could change. Samoa made a really strong start, two wins from two. One of them coming against the Aussie sevens. Can they overturn that deficit? That's to be decided. And the hero now, Argentina, through Tomas Elizalde, embark on a dangerous looking run. This is Ithgro. Schultz gets the offload. Moneta back inside. Oh, that's loose. My Samoa was hunting. Well taken though by Pelandini. And Elizalde bursting away. Gonzalez outside. Ithgro inside. Brilliant. Utterly brilliant. And Ethel is going to give it to Moneta. Maximum tries desired for Marcos Moneta. This is number 45. It will go down as another Ethel assist. But the stats won't show just how superbly crafted that was. Well, again, it's back and forth stuff. This time, Argentina swooping around with Elizalde. And he had options inside and out. Goes inside to Ithgro. And then on a plate for his mate. Dishes it off to the money man, Mineta. Couple of the guys at the top of the try scoring tree have been had a couple of freebies today, haven't they? In their hunt for the crown. There we go. Apollo Maliko got given one earlier. Climb up to 43. Mineta steps away again. 45 tries. How about that? It's another delicious narrative. There's somebody who's enjoyed some of the delicious offerings. This weekend, is that Peppa Pig? It's more like Daddy Pig to me. Well, Gonzalez, straight from the restart, is away. Clearly back off for Argentina. Quick fire it. double for Los Pumas. Right. And the harbingers of doom, Moneta and Gonzalez join forces. And that could be the ball game. Well. We just saw one freebie offering, and here's another. This time it's the bounce of the ball doing it for Argentina and for Gonzalez. But he deserves one in this game. Huh? Gonzalez. Sure what can't Luciano Gonzalez do? Okay. He's dropping conversions, he's swatting aside 110 kilo Fijians, he's scoring his 118th try as well. He is a specimen. Plays a lot of minutes as well. For a power play like that, to have the engine that he's got is something to behold. It really is. And Argentina are packed with guys like that. Rodrigo Ithilo is the one that always jumps out to me. 
And again, here he goes, Heathcrow on cue, offloading, and it's try time, Matteo Graziano. So many scores from restarts, so lethal in the air, and two hots for Fiji to handle. Well, this time it's Graziano in on the action. It's another restart, bounces up. This time it's Ithgrow that gathers the one-handed offload, the ball transfer one-handed offload to Graziano. They're so good scavenging in that area, this Argentinian team. Tobias Wades converts. And there you go, look at those restarts, that storm. Two out of five retained on a single error Tom made. <laughs> and they're playing both the Fijis as well. Such a big part of the game. There's different tactics as well. Argentina are doing really well on this chase. Just getting themselves positioned. They're not necessarily winning it in the air. They're winning it on the floor. And the weight of these restarts as well. Dropping right on the 10. Heathcote took it. El Azaldi. Oh, my goodness. It's a hat-trick of restart tries. <laughs> It's blistering, it's breathtaking. Fiji have no answer. Argentina, kings of the London skies. It's like a beautifully floated just over the 10 metre line. Such a skill as a kicker to be able to drop it. And it's pretty handy when you've got a man like Ithro to climb up and claim it out of the air. And you work on this in training, you position yourselves right. It's not just luck, the drop down giving yourself the best shot. 40 points to five. And here are the two of the most prolific men in Argentine history. The coach, Santiago Gomez Cora, 230. Marcos Moneta, still just 22 years of age, chasing down his 100th and chasing down, perhaps in the years ahead, his great coach. Finally, Five Argentina backwards. make a mess of a restart. And Fiji have it back through volley volley. It was getting unfair, wasn't it? It's almost a cheat code when you can boss the air as brilliantly as Argentina. Here's a break for Jenny Tuwai. Aging legs still carrying him on. Natungo supporting. Plenty of weight to both sides here for Fiji. And Dani Rova on to volley volley. Call away, number Penalty seven. Fiji, too high, off and running. Final play of the match. Can Fiji end it with a try? Argentina want the penalty, not getting there. it. Nanduvalo. Velawa, diminutive but dangerous. Mbakarerena taken offside by Tobias Wade. Penalty advantage. Penalty activated. The shadow of the Argentine posts. Oh! First Fijian try seems an awful long time ago, but Bakarerenga <laughs> does thunder his way home. It does ensure Fiji end with the second try, a minute into the Reds. Well, they're making kind of heavy weather. He got a couple of passes, might have done it. Batera Ringa with the power in the end. Kick goes over, and Argentina equal their heaviest ever victory over Fiji. It's a 28 point thrashing inflicted by Los Pumas. Full time score in Pool B Argentina 40. BG12.